he then utters and preaches the true name by guidance of guru the lord's light illumines the ocean and the earth the great cherisher of the world abides in three worlds when such divine comprehension arises then god shows his sight and mercifully enters into the mortal's own home descending low the ambrosial rain is incessantly falling the sublime words of the guru embellishes the mortal he who knows the secret of this one god is himself the creator and himself the luminous lord when the sun of divine comprehension arises the mortal slays the demons looks upward and contemplate on word the name in high and low beginning and end and the three worlds he sees the one lord all that the lord himself does utters and hears he the creator blesses us with mind and body that sublime creator i keep within my mind and mouth the lord is the life of the world there is no other nanak says by being imbued with the name the mortal obtains honor he who lovingly utters the name of the god the king engaging in combat overpowers his mind and night and day remains imbued with his lord's love he is renowned in the three worlds and four ages he who knows the lord becomes like him he is very pure and his body is sanctified in the love of the one lord he became happy in his mind in his mind he enshrines love for the true name be not get cross with the lord quaff his elixir thou art not to stay long in this world the kings the emperors and the paupers shall not remain they continue coming and going the four ages through everyone says he will remain here still none remains then before whom should i make a supplication when no one is permanent the soul word the name of the lord master is eternally if efficacious the guru alone blesses the mortal with honor and sound understanding my shyness 